Barista Wahab Shitu, the senior advocate of Nigeria, son, and lawyer engaged to ensure justice over the death of fast rising music young artist, Ilerionua Aloba aka Moman has said that the pathologist who conducted autopsy on the exhumed body of the late singer failed to state what caused the singer's death. Barista Wahab Shitu stated this on Wednesday while briefing journalists after the corona inquest court proceeding held in Lagos State. According to Wahab Shitu, the autopsy conducted on the body of late singer, Ilerionua Aloba aka Moman was said to have been unable to ascertain the cause of his death because the body was already decomposing. Wahab said the pathologist in charge of the autopsy told the coroner that the deceased body had decomposed by the time the test was conducted. Wahab stated in court thus, according to him, pathologist, the cause of death cannot be determined because by the time they conducted the test, the body had decomposed and that it is not possible for them to determine the cause of death. So, in summary, he is saying the cause of death cannot be ascertained. When you say the cause of death cannot be ascertained, it means it is suspicious, it is not clear. No particular reason. Shito added that the pathologist further stated that the lead singer may have died due to a reaction to certain drugs administered to him when he needed medical attention. He went further to say that he does not know whether it is those drugs that led to the death, he added. It would be recalled there was public outcry and mass protests when Mama died on September 12, 2023. He was said to have been buried immediately he passed on. Following public unrest and demand for justice, Mama's body was exhumed from the grave almost 10 days after burial for pathologists to conduct autopsy on the cause of death. Mama, who was signed to Naira Malis, Rikon Lemon was said to have suffered bullying and other forms of dehumanizing maltreatments in the hands of some persons who were later arrested over the death of the singer and subsequently released on bail as the trial court awaits corona inquest report. According to him, the cause of death cannot be determined. Because he gave a lot of reasons. He said, by the time they conducted the test, the body had discomposed. And that it is not possible for them to determine the cause of death. So in summary, he saying the cause of death cannot be ascertained. Now when you say because of death cannot be ascertained, it means uh, it is suspicious. It is not clear. No particular reason. But it's, he, he also went for that to say that uh, it, could be, it may be attributed to reaction to certain drugs administered on him before he died. Again, he then qualified that again to say he does not know whether it is those drugs huh? that actually led to his death. So, like uh, the other scenario we can mention, this is an inquiry into the cause and manner of death. The other fact that we are revealed today concerning this agreement between Mubad and his wife, and also the disagreement between Mubad and the Sandari and all that. Eh? All of this came out today from the testimony of uh, one of the witnesses. What is important is that this uh, pathologist has given his evidence today and uh, we have taken a day to examine him, to ask him questions on the report. So until those questions are asked, we cannot say this is the outcome. Osasuwa Kang Nebe, bringing you the news in a more digital way.